Alright, what I'm going to be doing is teaching you how to set up a Google Voice. This is simply good for if you don't want people to call you, even if you're not doing this rewards, it's good to have this because you might have somebody that you might not want them to call or know their regular number and you can get back to them whenever you want. You can call from your computer, headphones, and um, a microphone on your computer, you're able to call them. Um, so, installing the plug-in and all that stuff. All right, um, you'll have to install the plugin, and I'll show you where it's at. Well, I can't show you because it's already a plug in, but it'll show a plug in um spot on your um whenever you do sign up. <laughs> so this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and log into my Google. I'm gonna go up first to the search engine and put in Google Voice. All right. Bam. You can also put in Google Plus plugin and they'll send you straight to your download that you need. Alright, so we'll go to Google Voice, right? You can only use Google Voice if you have a Gmail. So the Gmail creation video I meant that I made, go ahead and look at that one first. So Google Voice. I'm gonna add an account. This is also for if you want to get a Google Voice out of state. No matter, I'm in Georgia. I can get a Google Voice anywhere. You just have to know the zip code or the area code. And I'm going to show you how to look that up too. Okay, this is what's going to happen. It's going to log into Google Voice. Give it a second. When you create a Gmail, all you have to do is log into Google Voice. You don't actually have to create an account. So, this is how you get started. You hit ISF terms, proceed. Alright, you would hit I want a new number phone put your phone number in six three dash six one zero one these are good for Craigslist posts because you get more calls if you have the actual area code that you're posting in so let me go ahead it's not gonna be home it's gonna be it's gonna be I'm gonna put it as work okay continue adding forwarding phone number oh should get a phone call. You hit call me now. Go rain in a minute. They're going to ask you for your two digit, digit verification code, as you see. Now you can record your voicemail reading if you want, but it's on you. That's what you want to do. So we're gonna do area codes, right? And we'll get my little book. I got because I'm actually gonna create one. Because I need to create one. So um, what I'm gonna do is uh, I got a little booklet right here, a little binder. Separate your business stuff, your notes and all that stuff. Separate it phone calls, who you close, everything. Separate this this book is worth about sixty thousand dollars. <laughs> That's how I look at it. Try not to leave home without it. So um, where's my Google Voice accounts and area codes that I can use? Um all right, here are my area codes. I've already got one. I think I'm gonna make one in Florida, Miami, right? So I'm gonna put Miami's area code in 305, right? I'm gonna search numbers. Cause that means I don't have any available. So you'll get a new area code. Um so about eight one three. 
<coughs> Search again. Okay, they got some area codes available. So you see this? This is my this is my area code sheet. So I'm going to write it down. You write down what email is under. Now, you'll be selecting your phone number. All right. Um, the first one might, the first few might not pop up, so we're gonna try the first one. Right. We're gonna continue. And congratulations, it was added. So you write that phone number down, and that's your Google Voice that they can call. All right. Simple as that. And that's how you can do it for out of state. You can do this for out of state. So. That's it. You have a nice one. Finish. Let me ask. Um, there might be something else. Never mind. Might be something else. Bam. Um, so whenever you log into your email that you do use your Google Voice for, um, you can block spammers also right here. You'll hit. You can hit yes or no. I'm gonna hit no thanks because I don't really go in there. But um. Your Google Voice number is right here, and whenever if you have more than one to one forwarding phone, like that phone number I put in, I have like four Google Voices attached to that forwarding phone. It will not ring your phone number, but it will leave a message in your in your email that you use the Google Voice for. They call, so and you'll just go in here, you'll go in your Gmail, and you'll check them, and you'll write them down, and you'll call them back simple as that so that's it that's how you set up a simple Google Voice all the settings you just find out the settings they're not hard to find um what else uh, that's it that's all I can think of you have a nice day if you have any questions put your comments at the section below and let me know hit like and subscribe appreciate it